Hey guys, how's it going? Today I want to do just kind of a quick review for you guys on the Zojirushi induction heating pressure cooker. Um, the model number is NPNVC10. Um, I hadn't seen too many reviews on this rice cooker. This is their highest end model they make. Um, so I thought I'd just kind of give you guys my two cents, just kind of based off my experience and let you know what I thought about it. Um, should mention real quick too that I actually found a pretty good deal on this rice cooker and I'll put a link in the description below. So you guys can check that deal out if you're interested in picking one up for yourself. So the NVC-10 is Zojirushi's highest end rice cooker that they make. If you're not familiar with Zojirushi, they're a Japanese company. And having just actually returned from Japan a few months ago, uh, I can tell you that every household in Japan has a Zojirushi rice cooker. They are what every single Japanese person use and for good reason, they make the best rice in the world in my opinion. Even if you go uh, in South Korea, a lot of the other uh, uh, Asian cities, um, they all use Zojirushi. They just make the best. And this is their best model. And in my opinion, worth the extra money over their standard um, rice cookers. Couple reasons why, uh, and I'll talk about that now. First of all, they uh, all of Zojirushi's rice cookers, except for I believe their lowest end model, uses their artificial intelligence fuzzy logic uh, computer chip system to perfectly cook rice. It will automatically adjust the pressure inside on this particular model because this is a pressurized version. The other, that's the big difference between them. This is a pressurized rice cooker. So what can it do? Um, for one, it can cook rice a lot quicker. Um, it has a quick mode, which the other ones don't. Because of the pressure, it will pressurize the rice and cook it in about 30 minutes. The standard cook time on most of these Zojirushi rice cookers are about 55 minutes. The standard cook time on this particular rice cooker is still 55 minutes, but there is a quick setting if you're in a hurry. And to me, you get about 95% the quality of rice that you get with the full one hour cook cycle. So it's very, very good at cooking rice in, uh, very quickly. Now, if you've never owned a very good quality uh, rice cooker like this one, the quick setting rice will be the best rice you've ever had. So don't get me wrong, it's not going, it's not just because it's short or doesn't mean it's bad rice by any means. It's still unbelievably good rice. Perfect rice by many people's standards, but uh, if you want the absolute utmost of flavor, you can do the standard cycle if you want. But like I said, the pressurized cooker like this one is the only one that does the uh, the quick rice setting, which is really handy if you're in a hurry. Now, the second reason why you might consider this one is if you like brown rice. If you like brown rice and eat it a lot, just get this thing. Don't even compare the other models. This is the one you want. It has the GABA brown rice feature. Um, which basically just means it cooks brown rice way better than any other rice cooker on the market out there. The other reason you would want to get this one is if you like the umami flavor. Um, umami is kind of a, it's a Japanese word, obviously, but it, it's kind of the, um, the savory taste. Uh, if you've never tasted it, it's kind of a different experience, but there is an umami setting on this uh, cooker which will cook the rice to have this umami flavor and it actually really does work well. The last and kind of to me one of the more important things, the reason you would want to consider this one is if you, if you eat a lot of rice, number one, but if you want to keep the rice um, over a, like say a week's period which this kind of freaked me out at first, but it's it actually works and it's safe. If you're like a couple or two or even a single person and say you want to make, you know, five cups of rice, that's way tons of rice more than you're ever going to eat in one day. What you can do is you can, it has an automatic um, like saver feature. Basically, you can close the lid and it will keep it sealed and, and ready to go for about a week. And it will steam it basically just real quick whenever you wanna eat it again. So you can make a large amount of rice and have it all ready for you over the course of the next week um, to eat whenever you want, which is really handy actually. 
But yeah, all in all, I really like this thing. Highly recommend it. Um, it just gives you simply the best rice you'll ever have in your life. Oh, it does make sushi rice too. I should I should mention also it has a sushi rice uh, setting on it as well. But yeah, anyway, if you have any more questions about it, um, just uh, leave them in the comments below. And if you're considering picking one up, don't forget uh, that link I put in the description below. So thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.